This is where it gets interesting. On a day where India has recorded its highest surge in terms of cases and deaths, restaurants in India are all set to reopen in what have been described as non-containment zones. However, there are also some strict guidelines that the owners and customers will have to follow. So let's walk you through some of these guidelines that will have to be adhered to. So all eateries have been asked to encourage takeaways as much as possible. Delivery boys will have to be thermally scanned before being sent out for delivery rounds and they'll leave the food packet at your doorstep to ensure that there is no physical contact. Sanitizers will now be made mandatory at the entrance of all restaurants and only customers and staff who are asymptomatic, that is, they don't exhibit any symptoms, will be allowed to enter into a restaurant. So, a restaurant can refuse service to you if you're displaying any symptoms of COVID-19. Needless to say that face marks have been made compulsory at the time of entering into the restaurant. So extra precaution has been advised for staff members who are at higher risk of infection. This includes older staff members, pregnant workers and also people with underlying illnesses. There will be a separate entry and egg an exit point for staff and customers and most importantly all restaurants will operate at about 50% capacity. So if you're planning to go dine out anytime soon then finding tables will not be the same as what it was the pre-pandemic era. Now customers have also been encouraged to use cashless payment methods while settling bills. Restaurant owners have also been advised to use disposable menu cards and also adhere to contact.